for the month of November 2017. This is a general reading for Libra Sun, Libra Rising, or Libra Moon. It might also be helpful for you to watch your rising and moon sign. You can join me on Facebook and Instagram for daily insights on tarot and astrology as well as my pay-per-view channel, vimeo.com slash thealchemistastrologer, where you can find on-demand pages for love, finance, and other readings. Now, the underlying energy is this Five of Cups. So you may just feel burned out. Uh, Maybe that's health. Maybe that's financial. Maybe it's emotional. There's a sense of pessimism or regret in connection to this card. Now, for those of you who are getting this blast from the past, this could be an old friend, a lover from the past, a lost love. Uh, Whatever it is, this month holds some sense of regret or unhappiness. There's some kind of emotional letdown. And again, with the temperance card, it could be some exaggerated pessimism. Maybe you're dealing with a love situation or some marital issues or some family problems, uh, some, some separation or feeling of being abandoned, or maybe you're abandoning something. You're not happy. You're turning your back on a partnership or connections or a situation uh, because you, you just feel a sense of grief. Now, some of you, if this is about resources, maybe you feel an actual tangible loss. Maybe your possessions have been taken away for, for whatever reason. Uh, but this is a card that's very much rooted in a mindset about the past. It's about being stuck in the past. So this month, you need to be especially careful that you're not chaining yourself to the past, that you open yourself up to new possibilities. Whatever's going on this month, you are going to question what you're doing. You're going to have periods of doubt where you're wondering if your work means anything, if your goals are the ones, you know, maybe you started off enthusiastic about something and now it's not as fulfilling for you as it once was. And maybe the people that are connected to you, are they really sincere? Do they have your best interests at heart or they're just pretending? So there's a lot of inner conflict. You're grappling with, you know, differences between your logic and your emotions. And the temperance card could be trying to find that mix between your head and your heart, trying to find uh, that middle path, whatever it is that makes you feel healed and whole. This is going to be a month to not give in to depressive thoughts. Uh, and part of that may be coming up with something that gives you hope, something that you can look forward to, especially if you've been dealing with disappointments or challenges or setbacks. You need that thing uh, that is at the, 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 that's the light at the end of the tunnel. Now, if you change the way you're thinking, the way you're thinking about the past, you may be very surprised at how smoothly things go, especially when you understand that you are capable. So there could be some kind of stroke of luck for you this month, you know, that are that is tied to your hopes, your dreams, and it may go beyond what you were expecting. Again, some kind of unexpected gift, connection, opportunity, uh, or just the gift of knowing that you need to take some action. Getting stuck in this mode of giving up, you know, what's the point, is not serving you. It's just growing your worries. It's manifesting what you don't want. And some of you, you know, it could be you've been in this battle where you've been trying to Uh, save other people or do things for other people because, you know, you feel like you're assisting them. But the truth is, they may need to help themselves. Uh, You 
the issue comes from you expecting too much of others. You expect too much from them. You expect too much from yourself. This is about letting people do for themselves and you watching your back, you taking care of you. And mindset is especially important this month. If you expect the worst, you manifest the worst. Uh, you tend to attract what it is you believe will happen. So this is about becoming aware of what you're doing, uh, getting involved with people, or because there's likely a connection to the past, re-involve with people or situations or habits that continuously let you down and disappoint you. So be careful not to disappoint yourself in the choices that you're making. This is going to be a month of emotional developments, ambitious developments. Uh, there's, you know, it may be focused on uh, your dreams or manifesting the impossible. And there's going to be a bit of drama in your life this month. The good part is you're going to have a chance to clarify some things, to get clear, to improve, to repair something if need be. That, and that's going to allow you to operate on a much better level. You only have one major card. That is the temperance card. So again, the key to your success this month is compromise and moderation. There's some dilemma that you're facing. You're trying to figure something out. You're trying to make a decision. And it could have to do with what's fair or being more efficient, being more on top of things. And it's likely that this is a month where you're going to experience some kind of turmoil. Something outside of you is at work in your world. There's some unexpected changes that are going to come due to other people. Now, you have some bright ideas. There's something that you want to do, and it's time for you to stop, uh, you know, standing still. It's time for you to move forward and put those great ideas into action. Maybe there's uh, an involvement with somebody who has to make a decision, possibly that queen of swords. This is somebody that's going to make the final decision after they've considered everything. Maybe they're a decision maker in general, maybe a judge, a person of authority. Maybe you're going for a position of authority. Whatever you're involved in, it may have to do with changing the course of other people's lives. So th there's going to be, in some cases, an antagonistic atmosphere where somebody wants to get something moving, moving and yet maybe there's some resistance. But in spite of this resistance, somebody is going to go ahead and, and move forward. They're going to move anyway on something. 